An ecological footprint to me is the impact you leave on the earth, like what, it, whether it be how much energy you're using or not using, and whether you recycle, how much you recycle, just with the impact you have on the environment. What's my ecological? E how do you say it? Ecological footprint. I'd say I'm like a size six, but like in designer shoes, I'm like a size seven, but we don't tell people that because size seven feet are ginormous. <laughs> yeah. My ecological footprint, I'm hoping it's pretty small because that's how I'd like it to be. I would like it to be small. Ecological footprint. Um, let's see. I guess does, I don't know, does that mean like what you waste? My name is Beth and I live with Jillian. Hi, um, my name is Jillian. <laughs> I live with Beth and it is so much fun. Do I look at the camera? Do I look at, okay. Do I look okay? Okay. kind of difficult sometimes. Oh, I always have to go after her to turn the lights off or turn the water off because she leaves the water running and she doesn't care if the lights are on all day. And Living with Beth is... Well, to be honest, she's a little uptight. I don't know, she always gets like mad at me. Sorry. Oh, my cell phone, sorry. Hello? Beth is uptight because she's one of those like tree huggers you know I I know that's like a slang term that's like calling someone a cracker or something like she's total tree hugger sitting in a park in Paris France reading the news and it sure looks bad they won't give peace a chance there was just a dream some of us had Still a lot of lines to see But I wouldn't want to stay here It's too old and cold And settled in its ways here All but California California Coming home I'm gonna see the folks I dig I'll even kiss a sunset pig California I'm coming home have the smallest bladder ever because she flushes the toilet like 10 times a day and seriously if it's not number two you can just leave it in there you know it's all right
every time she leaves the house, she leaves her stereo on, she leaves the TV on, she leaves all the lights on, so I have to go by behind her and turn them all off because I'm not going to waste energy like that. I do not leave the TV. Okay, maybe I leave the TV on sometimes, but it's for the animals because... They like to watch the news too because I'm gone all day long and they just, um, they get lonely. So I leave some music on, the TV on, just like if they were real people and they need to be entertained, just like anybody else, right? Or even save okay. more money. Well, I'm gonna go. Bye, Beth. No matter what size your mortgage is, refinancing with a Smart Choice loan could put thousands of dollars back in. She does this all the time. She'll put one shirt or a pair of jeans in the washer and that's it. And she'll just waste all that water and all the detergent and all the energy. Well, I have a, a small car, and it's an older one, and I drive just as much as I need to, not anymore if I can help it. I drive to school because I have to. There's not a whole lot to do in Naples, so I kind of like to just go driving. It kind of calms me to just turn the engine on and drive along the highways and just drive drive and drive not really go anywhere just drive in circles to make sure that my ecological footprint is small I recycle as much as I can anything I can I don't leave the lights on I don't leave the water running I don't waste electricity I try to conserve as much as I can I am NOT wasteful Like, she comes behind me and she's all like, turn the lights off, turn the lights off. And I'm like, I pay for those lights. If I want to leave them on, I can leave them on if I want to. I really like bright things. And like, I like things to be pretty and just open. And, and I don't really like opening the windows, but I like making it feel like the sun is in the house.